Hello. Yes, hello, Tree. Can you hear me? Yes. All right. Good evening to you. How are you doing? I'm guys. All right. Wonderful. All right, Tree. So we're going to continue our lesson last time. Can you still remember what we have talked about? Talking. Yeah, we talk about speaking, right? <laughs> speaking. And what was our topic last time? Can you still remember what is our topic? What was our topic last time? Do you still remember? No. No? I remember that about hiking, traveling. You remember that topic? Yeah. All right. And before that, we also talk about speaking class, right? About yes. pictures. Remember the pictures? The one who forgot her coat. Remember that? Yes. Okay. All right, then, three. So we're going to continue our topic. So let me share my screen again. But before that, I just want to ask whether... How is your day today? How is your day? How is your day today? It's Sorry, it's Tuesday. It's Tuesday. Okay, it's Tuesday today. And how is your Tuesday? How is Tuesday? Is it fun, boring, sleepy day? Well, how do you describe this day? Tuesday, today, is it boring day? Is it fun day? Is it a normal day? How is it? It's normal day. It's a normal day. Do you stay at home or did you go out? I'm going to school. Ah, you went to school, I see. All right. And what did you study today? What did you learn today? What subjects? I study Vietnamese math and science. Oh, you got three subjects today, Vietnamese math and science. I see. And how is it? Is it difficult or easy? Easy. Easier. Wow, that's good to hear, right? So you find the subjects easy. Do you have homeworks today? Yes. Oh, you do. All right. Finish with your homeworks. Yes. Oh, good. Good job then. All right. So you're a good student then. So we continue. Let's start our lesson now. Can you see my screen? Yes. Do you remember this words tree? Can you read it one by one again? Backpack. Okay. Goggles. 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 Good. Helmet. 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 All right. Hiking boots. Very good. Next word. Lantern. 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 Okay. Next. Sky jacket. Ski. I remember you repronounce this one as always ski. Okay. You always mistake this one as sky, but you pronounce this one as ski. Okay. Can you read this one again? Ski. Ski jacket. All right. Good. This one. Ski pants. Very good. And lastly, we have the word cane. Good job. So we have cane. Okay. Next. Okay, uh, I know we have answered this one, but we need to review. Okay, what is this picture? Can it's you tell me? Backpack. It's a backpack. Very good. What about this one? It's Google. Not Google. Goggles again. How do you pronounce this one? Goggles. Can you say it again? 
Three, can you say the word? Goggles. Goggles. All right, so this is goggles. What about this one? What do you call? Ski pants. Very good, that's ski pants. But this one, of course, this one is lantern. What about this one? It's ski jacket. Very good, ski jacket. And this one, what do you call? Is helmet. Very good, that's helmet. And this one, you call this? What do you call this one? Yeah. Okay. Hold on. All right. So go back. Going back. What is this again, Tree? It's hiking boots. Hiking boots. And lastly, this is a cane. Okay, good. All right. So kind of remember this word, so right, Tree? Let's move forward. Yes. Um they moved this part before. And now let's try. Uh, we answered this one as well before, right? Yes. Okay, we go on this part. We have to arrange the words into a correct sentence, okay? We have to arrange the words to a correct sentence, okay? So let's try doing this. Can you try doing it, Pri? Do you know what to do, three? Yes. Okay, sure. What's your answer for number one, three? Yes, we are going cave exploring. We are going cave exploring. We are going cave exploring is correct. Good job. Good job. All right. That's good. What about number two? Yes. What's your answer for that? It feels it cold in the cave. It feels, can you read again? It feels. It feels cold. In cool. The cave. All right. It feels cool in the cave. Let's try to check if it's correct. All right. That's correct. Three. Good job. Good job. All right. Okay. What about number three? It's everyone is wearing a helmet. Helmet. Okay, everyone is wearing a helmet. Let's try to check if you're correct. Wow, another correct answer. Good job. What about number four? He is carrying a backpack. Oh, let's try to check it. Good job. That's correct, Tree. He is carrying a backpack. Wow, good job. Okay, give me a high five for giving me correct answers for everything. All right, good job. Okay, for this one, you need to look and write the sentences using the B verbs. Okay, do you understand like my family? Okay, yes. for this one, how are you going to write the sentence for this one? My family. Going rock, 
thing today. Okay. What are you going to write in between? My family is, are, am, was, were. What are you going to put? I'm going to put what I'm going to write in today. Sorry. My family. How are you going to write? My family. Going thing today. Uh, what are you going to put? Is, are, my family is going rafting today. My family are going rafting today. What is your answer, three? Is my family are going today. Okay, the correct answer is, okay, is because my family is a singular, meaning it's a one, it's one group, okay? They understand, mm -hmm. three? Even there are many members in the family, but you are counted as one. Okay, you are counted as one. So the correct answer is, my family is going rafting today. What about number two? We have the word we. We are going to the mountain. Okay, we are going to the mountains. Then that is correct. Okay, good job. Okay, so do you understand the difference three? Yes. Okay, what about number three? We are wearing helmets. Okay, we are wearing helmets. Very good. What about number four? We are wearing life jackets. Very good. We are wearing life jackets. Next. We are wearing shorts. All right. Good. Wow. And lastly. We are wearing aqua shoes. All right. Good job. So you got another perfect score. Three. Give me another high five. Okay. So only take note for number one. Because my family, as what I said, is just counted as one. So you're going to use the word is, okay? Singular. Okay, good job. Now, let's try to write words about your family activities on the mountain. So you're going to choose we. Um, what do you usually do as a family? As a family, what do you do? Three. Do you go camping? Are you going? Do you go camping together as a family? Three. No. No, you don't do. What about um? What about sleeping in a tent? Have you tried doing it as a family? No. Not yet? Oh, I see. What about... What about... <laughs> okay. Um, okay, maybe let's try to... Have you been to the mountain tree? No. Not yet? Oh, I see. That's the reason why. Okay, but let's just assume that your family was able to go to the mountain before okay let's just imagine that you and your family has been have been to the mountain okay what do you think are you going to do in the mountain what activities are you going to do here hiking. sorry we are hiking okay so we are hiking one it could be hiking right good job then what else instead of hiking? Yeah, skiing, exploring. Uh, sorry, exploring. You are cave exploring. Yeah. I see. Yes, the family could be cave exploring, right? Have you been into a cave? Have you seen a cave? Yes. Oh, I see. It's quite dark. Did you see? It's very dark, right? And do yeah. you like the smell of the cave? How is the smell of the cave? How is it? Do you remember the smell of the cave? Do you remember it? 
Do you remember mm -hmm. the smell of the cave? No? No more? Yeah, yeah. It's not so good, right? <laughs> All right. Next, what else do you think you're going to do? Do you think you're going to sleep in a tent together? No. I... Oh, do you think what? Going up to the mountain and go home at night. Go home at night, so you're not going to stay in the mountain. Why do you think you don't like to stay on the mountain? Because I scared the dark. Ah, you are scared of the dark. I see. It's okay to be scared of the dark, right? Especially that it's true that many are that because many are many wild animals at night, right? There are many animals at night. So good job, good job. Okay, going back. Okay. So what else? So you go for hiking, you do cave exploring. What else? Give me one more activity. Do you think you're going to wear a sun hat? Yes. Okay, so we are wearing sun hat. Okay, <laughs> so as you can do that. All right, and for example, this is your father, okay? For example, my father. What do you think your father is going to do? My father carrying a backpack. Is carrying a backpack. Good job. What else, my father? What else do you think? Aside from carrying a backpack, what do you think? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> what do you think? What else? My father wearing a can to climb to hiking. Sorry, bring is bringing a cane. Is that correct? Yes. Okay, so your father is bringing a cane. Good job. And what about your mother? My mother. What do you think? My mother. My mother is wearing a hiking boots. Sorry? Is wearing a hiking boots. Very good. Or is wearing a pair of hiking boots. Very good. What else? In the rope. Sorry, and rope. My mother is bringing a rope. Is that correct? Yes. Okay, good job. And what about you? Can you make sentence? I... I carrying a lantern. I am. I am carrying a lantern. Good job. What else? I am carrying a helmet. Again, I am wearing, not carrying. You don't carry. I am wearing. I am wearing a helmet. Okay, good job. Good job, okay? All right. So you're able to, to write a story, so... 
So, okay, um, for the next meeting three, you're going to take the exam, okay? You're going to have exam for the next time, okay? I mean, next Saturday, you're going to take a test with me, all right? But we're going to continue a lesson today. We're still going to continue a lesson, but take note that you're going to take a test with me, all right? Do you understand this one? Okay, three. Okay, so let me go back first. Let me get the next lesson, okay? Because we're finished to 24. B. We're going to do the unit 25. Still have time, still a lot of time. Good job, three. Okay, for this time, we're going to have a new topic. Okay, we're going to have a new topic. Can you see my screen? Okay, can you read the words? Which one is different? Okay, which one is different? Okay, write words for the pictures. Draw another picture and complete the sentence, okay? Okay. Um, okay, um, this one, let's try to look. Do you know how to put a line three? Can you put the connect? Can you connect the words? What do you call it? Of course, this one is an armchair, right? Okay. What about this one? You call this? What do you call this one? This one? Uh, sofa. It's a sofa. Very good. What about this one? Uh... A fan. Okay, a fan. Very good. Next, it's a? A towel. Okay, a towel. Very good. What about this one? It's a bird. It's a bird. Okay, what about this one? It's a bird. Okay, it's also a bird. Okay, or actually you don't say bird, it's called it beard. Okay, how do you say it? Beard. Can you say it again? Beard. Beard. All right, good. What about this one? What do you call this one? It's plane. It's a plane. We are good. And this one you called it? Kite. Okay, good job. Okay, kite, beard, and so far. Okay, of course, this isn't also a beard, right? Okay, let's try to complete the sentences three. Okay, number one, can you read the sentence? Uh. Uh, plan. A plane and a kite can fly. Okay, a plane and a kite. Sorry, a plane, a kite, and can you think of another word that can fly? What else do you think that can fly? In the helicopter, can fly. All right. A plane, a helicopter, and a kite can fly. Good job. All right. Of course. Oh, you can see also a bird, but helicopter is also correct. Okay. Number two. The three men had got a beard. Okay. Beard. Okay. But... Of course, actually, you have to draw another man with a beard, but you don't have to do it. I understand that one. So you don't have to do that. I've got beards with S, okay? Number three. The fan, 
the tower and the orange are orange. And the orange? Yes. All right. Of course, the fruit orange is also called your orange. Good job. Okay. So you can have fan and towel. And you say, or, or you can say the t-shirt is color orange, okay, but mine is color red now. Okay, good job. Number four. You can buy an armchair, a sofa, and a... What do you think? And a table in a living room. Okay, good. A table in the living room. Good job. That's a good observation, right? Or you can also say TV, right? But tell a table is always like every living room has a table, right? Good job, yeah. three. Good job. Good job. Now let's write a bit of vocabulary. Okay, so let me read first the words armchair. Armchair. Good. Fan. Fan. Or I can say three that you can specifically call this one electric fan. Can you say it? Electric fan. Electric fan. No, no S. Electric fan. Can you say that? Electric fan. Okay. Because definitely it has electricity, right? It's because you can use this one like this one. Can you see me? Yes. So I'm also fanning myself. So you can just simply call this a fan, right? Okay. Yes. Because some other pictures, let me share you my screen. Other way to understand this is, for example, this one. Fan. You can think of a fan like this, but hand fan. You call this one hand fan as well, okay? Have you seen this one before? Yeah. Okay, so you also call this a fan, but this one you call it hand fan, okay? So yeah. the first one, you called it electric fan. This one you called a hand fan, all right? Yeah. Good. good job, good job. Let's go to the next part. What do you read this one? Uh, uh, this one is so far. So far. Okay, so far. Good job. Next part. Toothbrush. Toothbrush. Good job. Okay, good job. Next part. Say which picture is different. Okay, I want you to tell me which picture is different. Okay? Okay, we have one, two, three, four, five sets here and tell me which of the first picture, um, first set is, um, does not belong to the group, okay? okay? Okay, for number one, can you tell me what can you see first? What are the pictures? What are those pictures? It's a rain. Okay, rain. it's raining. Mm -hmm. What about the second picture? It's a snowman. It's a snowman, right? And the third picture, it's? It's the sun. It's a sun. Good job. Then, the last picture. The hippo. It's a hippo, right? It's hippopotamus. All right, three. Which of those, among those four pictures, which do not belong? Which does not belong to the group? Which do not belong there? Yeah. What do you think? This one, this one, this one, this one. The hippo is different. Okay, the hippo is different among because, can you tell me why? Because rainy, winter, and sunny is okay. the weather. It's okay. They are weathers, right? They are types of weather. And this one is? Animals. Okay, good. It's an animal. Good job. All right. What about this one? Can you describe to me? Okay, it's a rabbit. A mouse. 
Okay, but on the rabbit, where is the rabbit first? Where is the rabbit? It's under the table. Okay, next one. It's the mouse. It's under the table. Good job. What about the third one? The bird is on the table. All right. And lastly, we have... A lizard is under the table. Okay, is it a lizard or a crocodile? I don't, okay, yeah, lizard because of the tongue here, right? It's a lizard. Okay, so which of the pictures here does not belong to the group? It's a bird. Okay, the bird. Why the bird? Because it's on the table. Okay, because that's the only animal that's just on the table. All right, good job. Next one, number three. Can you describe it? The man who is flying is different. Okay, I'll uh, describe it one by one. The man is crying. Next is the man is laughing. Okay, then? The woman is laughing. Okay, and? The man is laughing. Okay, the man, or we can talk about this one is a boy, right? This one looks like a boy. Boy, and this one is a man. All right. Then, of all the pictures there, which one is different? Yes. Which one is different? Yes. Which one is different? What? Yes. Which yes. one is different? First, second, third, fourth. The picture one, the man the is crying. Okay, the man who is crying. Good job. Now, let's go to the fourth picture. Can you describe? The baby is going to the playing with a panda. Okay, panda. Second one. Second one, the baby is playing the kangaroo. Okay, playing kangaroo, right? Kangaroo. The girl is playing with a kangaroo. What about the fourth one? The third one. The third is the baby is going to the Playing with, the baby is teddy playing bear. with, with, teddy bear. with a bear, right? You call it bear. Okay, good. And the fourth one. The fourth one, the baby is, is playing with a ball. With a ball. Okay, among the pictures there, which one does not belong? Which one do not belong, three? The girl is playing a ball. Okay, the one who is playing the ball. Good job. Now, the fifth picture, can you describe it to me one by one? This is five. This one is the pencil. It's a pencil or a color pencil. Okay. All right. Next one. The second one is a comic. Okay, it's a comic book. All right. And the third one? The third one is a phone. It's a phone. All right. And the fourth one? The fourth one is a book. It's a book. Okay, now three. Among the four pictures there, which do not which do not which does not belong to the group? It's a comic. Comic books? Why do you think? Because the pencil, the phone, and the book are blue. <laughs> Our color blue. All right, that's a good choice, right? But actually, the correct answer is the pencil. You know why? Because this one is used for write, right? For writing. And the rest, you read them. You read a comic book, you read. You can see the word here, message. You read the message and of course you read the book all right three <laughs> but i like your observation so i will get your answer as correct because of course everything is color blue except the comic book all right so give me a high five because i find that correct as well good job 
Okay, good job. All right. Very smart and very observant. Okay. For sure, you can score high to that with the test that I will give you on Saturday. All right. So let's go to the next part. Good job, three. Okay, we're going to read the story. Do we still have time? Yeah, we still have time, so we can do this. Read the story, choose a word from the box, right? The correct word next to numbers one to six, okay? Okay. Can you read? What pet can you got? What does your pet eat? Okay, um, we're going to choose the correct title or the best title for this one. But first, kindly read. We're going to talk about I Daisy mean, for another time. Daisy loves animals. Lots of her friends have pets and Daisy wants one, two. Wanted one, one day, two. Wanted one, two. One day... She read a story in a comic about a boy who had a horse. Okay. Daisy had an idea. Mom, she said, I want to learn to ride a horse. Very good. Have a horse. Sorry, Daisy. Her mother answered. You can have a horse. We haven't got a field. What about a kitten? Then Daisy asked. My friend Sally got a cat. No, Daisy, her mother said. Mm -hmm. we, we live in a flat cat. Like we live in a flat cat. Has like being in gardens. gardens. Okay. All right. Next part. Can you read? Daisy went and sat on the balcony. She wasn't happy. But then she saw really sweet. Really sweet. Gray Lisa on the ground between two pretty green plants. Plants, okay. okay. And moves is moves it. Move it downstairs, up and down. Move it downstairs, up and down. Can you move the downstairs? Yeah. Can you move the downstairs, up and down? If you say downstairs, so it's only going down. But can you put the downstairs up and down, up and down? Can you move that? Downstairs? It's too heavy, right? The downstairs are too heavy. You cannot bring it up, right? Unless you have rope, okay? What do you think? This one is talking about the downstairs. The lizard, look at Daisy. It, you're talking about the lizard, right? What do you think? Hmm. Move it. What do you call this part of the body? Cloudy. How do you call this part of the body? This part, you called it? Head. Okay. It moves its heads up and down, right? You can go up, down, right? The lizard moving up, down, up, down, okay? So read this one again. The lizard. The lizard looks, looks looked at Daisy. Daisy. Looks no S, no S. Look at Daisy and move his head up and down. Wow, he's saying yes. <laughs> Laughs. Daisy is different from all my friends. Best. Friends, bad. That's okay. 
But that's okay. All right. Three, what do you think is the title for the story? It's the title of the story. What do you think? What do you think is the answer? What's the title of the story? Lazy bed? No, look, whether what have you got? What pet have you got? Or what does your pet eat? What do you think? I've got a cat. And my cat eats the fish. Oh, okay, you got a fish. All right. Okay, for this one. Yes, Daisy finds a pet. Okay, Daisy finds a pet. Good job, All right? So that is the best title for the story. And you said that you also got a pet and it's a fish. Oh, I see. Okay, is it a big one? Is it a big one? Is it big yeah. or just small? How big is your how big is your fish? Three? How big is it? Small. How like this? Yes. All right. All right. See, so that's cute. That's a cute fish. And where is your fish? It's in the. Where is your fish? What do you call that? Aquarium, okay? Is your fish in aquarium? Yes. Aquarium. Okay, this one. Aquarium, right? Yes. Okay. How do you say the word three? It's aquarium. All right, aquarium. Okay. Have you seen this one, Ocean Park Aquarium? Have you been yeah. to this park? Have you seen this one before? Have yeah. you been to this place? It's very good, right? It's very amazing. It's very big, right? Whoa, the fish are so big, right? Right, so wow. It's a very big aquarium, right? But this one is the Philippines. What about in Vietnam? Oh, this one in Vietnam. All right. Oops, not this one. A minute, a minute. Okay. Oh, I see. Vin Pearl. Is this the one that you went to? Is this the place that you visited? Vin Pearl. Three Win. Aquarium, the same name as yours. Mm. Mm, wow, have you seen this one? It's in. Oh, sorry, I don't know the name of the oh, Kangwa province. Is it near mm. yours? Sorry, like this one Fish Island. Or this is the new name, Hom Yi Wong Yun. Do you know this place? Not yet? Yes, it does. It has my name. <laughs> right, yeah. It has your name, right? So you see, wow. This is nice, right? It's a big <laughs> ship outside. Oh, that's the place. He will be. Oh, you see, where is it? Look on the map, it's here. Look on the map, it's here. It's near. Oh, near Ho Chi Minh. It's the south, on the south, Vietnam. On this island, small island there, right? This one. Yeah. It's very small. Wow, right? It's near the one Ho Chi Minh there. But you see, you spread this island there, Philippines here. 
<laughs> right? So yeah, uh, that's nice. It's nice. And you're here, right? Very far. You're very far. Oh, no, this one is China, this one. You're here, right? You're somewhere here? I'm in the two. Where are you? You're in the? In the two. In the top? Okay, next time we'll look for it. <laughs> it's very hard to look at a very small picture, but you see, you can see a lot of, uh, of shifts here. Okay, for the meantime, three, we're going to stop our lesson tonight. I hope you enjoyed and prepare for your exam, okay? Can you do good for your exam coming this coming Saturday? Do you think you can, go, you can do good? Yeah. All right, good job. Okay, give me another high five. Good luck for your exam, all right? And see you on Saturday. And goodbye, three. Bye. Bye. -bye.